What are the most iconic anime openings of all time? I don't know, so I had to search it up to find the answer. And it was just this. I don't want this. I could not find a video like this one I am making right now and it was... <laughs> so, I'm here to deliver what you send. Yes. So I went to my YouTube community, Twitter, and even to an outside world of Reddit. And all I asked was, what are the most iconic anime openings? And you guys sent me so many openings that you thought were iconic, and I had to sort it all out. And I made a top five list by compiling everyone's answers into a tally chart. These openings are some of the most goddamn iconic openings I know of. Because you said they were. And the list that you guys made is scarily close to GamerAnts.com's list. Number five, again for Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Number four, Cha La Hecha La for Dragon Ball Z. Number three, Tank for Cowboy Bebop. Number two, Hikaru Nara for Your Lion April. And now we are up to the number one. What could it be? Well, number one is a cruel angel's thesis for Neon Genesis Evangelion. And that is the top five list for Gamerant's iconic openings. So now let's go back to the original voice. Peanut butter. So now let's get into the most iconic anime openings of all time that you have picked. Yeah man, number five is DBZ, Dragon Ball Z, Chala. Chala. Now, now, now. You guys made this and this. I, I did not do any votings or anything like that because I wanted to know what you thought. And this is the number five song on the list. But there's something about this song that's just... Oh yeah. Now how is this opening iconic? The constant flowing catchiness is like a driving hook. You just want to keep listening and listening to the song. And then Hironobu Kageyama's broad vocals hooks you in even more with the catchiness. This song just knows how to hook you in and grab your attention. Now the visuals in this opening are just fun segments and it just works! To be honest, I can't really see a looking out the window with rain type of opening for Dragon Ball Z. Okay, but I really love Gohan running on Shinron. <laughs> like, look at his smile, it's just so cute. But this strong, catchy song is what really carries this opening. I just don't know how to unravel this anymore. <laughs> I've said what I could say. <laughs> But now I can unravel this opening. Unravel, the song name, is trying to imply a sense of losing yourself. The singer, Toru Kitajima, is trying hard to not be forgotten and to not forget who he is. And that correlates to Kaneki, who doesn't want to forget that he is a human and to not be forgotten by the people around him when he's slowly turning into a ghoul. But the gentle whispering vocals with the fluid instruments to the chaotic breakdown is just like losing yourself whilst listening to the song. But then we build up to the driving chorus which has just made this opening so goddamn popular. Like look how many views it has. That's a lot of views. But what I picked up with this song is that Kitajima's soft vocals with the chaotic instruments is like trying to find yourself in all this chaos. A human or a ghoul. But we see this throughout the whole opening with the reflections of both sides of Kaneki until we see him accept his fate and the reflections become one. But I do got to say that once again, the song is what made this iconic. But I do got to say it would be nice to have an iconic opening that is more from the visuals. Huh. This opening sucks. There's no vocals. What? Take that back. Take it. We got all the vocals that we need. Okay, three, two, one, it's jam. The alluring vocals from the very beginning hook you in for the blasting up-tempo jazz beat which goes on throughout the rest of this opening. Tank is shoving eye-catching visuals towards you which is constantly grasping your attention. It's so, oh, it's so mesmerizing. The opening does what it needs to do. And that's by showing you the main characters of the show and giving you hints of the themes throughout the spaceships and guns. And the simplicity of this is just what makes it so memorable for so many people. But I do got to say that this opening is a visual and audio stimulating treat. You don't need lyrics for a song to be good. And this opening proves it. I wanna be the very best. 
But no one ever was. Come on, who doesn't know that line? This song has stapled itself into millions of people's lives. So many of us grew up with Pokemon around us. It's a massive piece of pop culture for the entire planet. So this opening isn't really a massive surprise for being on here for me. It's just iconic. But why is it iconic? The guitar and drum that just punches you in the face. The lyrics that empower you. The cadence that's easy to go along with. It's just a very grounded song. Now if you pay attention to the lyrics, you'll actually find out that this song is about doing your best to succeed in your dreams. The only way to be the very best is to train, learn, and believe. And you'll meet friends along the way and learn from them too. You'll grow as a person whilst on your journey for succeeding your dreams. Who knew that a Pokemon opening would be this inspiring? Well, that is if you want to be the very best, like no one ever was. Okay, okay, how have I never watched this anime before? This opening is just so good. And it's the number one most iconic opening that y'all recommended. But is the list that you guys created any good? Comment down below. I'm gonna say that they're great openings and I can see how they are iconic, especially this one. Cruel Angel's Thesis. I actually added this to my playlist after listening to it for my first time. I'm gonna be jamming to it for a long ass time, I'm gonna tell you that for sure. But the gentle biblical start of the song goes with the visuals of the characters gracefully moving against cutted skies. To the sudden upbeat funky beat which matches with the visuals quickly changing to match with the beats. We're already going on a roller coaster ride and that's without even talking about Yoko Takahashi's delicate vocals. Which is just so beautiful and blend in so well with the instruments. All of this makes this song feel like planets are dancing through the cosmos because of the catchy hypnotizing beat. I can see how this opening is the most voted iconic opening. It got me feeling nostalgic and I've never listened to it before. This is just one of the best openings I have ever heard. It's just oh, <laughs> I'm gonna be listening to this opening a lot, so thank you for like recommending it to me by voting for it and telling me about it. Uh, yeah. And yeah, that is the, the top, top five most iconic anime openings of all time that you what was the thing that made these iconic? Oh yeah, I got a haircut. Ooh. I noticed that all these openings had a moment that was memorable. But that is the main factor that I picked up on. But what I mean for memorable is a catchy chorus that you can just sing along to. A breakdown that just hooks you in. A visually stimulating time. A world renowned popular line. And a beat that gets you bopping. But another factor is that all these songs were great to listen to. Now what openings will be iconic in the future? Well, I'll be talking about the next one in my next video. The Chainsaw Man opening. But hey, that's all for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. I'm sorry that it took a lot longer to edit um, and get out. Uh, it's just so many things. It's just like I was just demotivated to edit. You know when you have those blocks to do stuff that you love and you're like, Ugh. that's what happened to me. But I got over it finally and I've been working on other videos as well. So I was like kind of, Ugh. and also an update on my health. I am nice and healthy. My balls are fine. There we go. But seriously, everyone, check your body to see if you got any lumps. Make sure you're healthy and all that stuff because I care about you and I don't want you to not notice something that is lumpy on your body and you need to go get it checked. But yeah, other than that, thank you all for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, show some support by leaving a like. Comment down below what your favorite opening or other openings that you think should have been in the top five list. And uh, also subscribe for future content because that Chainsaw Man video, it is going in depth for like a minute 30 content video goddamn but then after that it's the anime but anyways peace